goody, what's goody, what's goody? You know this is your boy Andy Appleseed. Andy Appleseed TV is the name of the channel. Make sure you like, share, hit your boy with a comment. If you're new here, hit that subscribe button one time. We got the latest and greatest hip hop news in these YouTube streets. Let's get it in, let's go. Latest news hit the social. Make sure you smack that like button. We're going to take this one straight to the BX. Shout out goes out to Fat Joe, just recently jumped on social media and reacted to a trending story. Now for the past two days, we all saw Shaka Khan was trending. This was fresh after she did an interview and it seems like she called out Mary J. Blige and a long list of other R&B acts that she wasn't feeling. She just spoke her mind at the time and didn't realize she was being disrespectful. But a few days later, she quickly apologized. She said, you know, this was not really her intentions to go on an interview and disrespect any R&B singer. She was actually spent around by the media. We all know how it goes when it comes down to doing podcasts and interviews, she wasn't really well prepped for it. Hopefully apology will be accepted by Mary J. Blige and the rest of the crew. But let's jump straight into this live stream moment by Fat Joe. He actually reacted to this. He wanted to address the fact that sometimes the media does paint that narrative. And behind the scenes, sometimes the celebrities have to deal with some of the things that they say on interviews, but they don't really mean. They just get caught like a deer in headlights at the time. So let's jump straight into the words of Fat Joe. Ladies, news did that social. Did that like button. What about these other rappers and what they doing? What about they girls? The serious uh, allegations or feelings that the media, like Vibe Magazine, magazines amped up that East Coast, West Coast beef. And we know what happened. Biggie died, Tupac died. Kenny Burns, living legend. Tupac died. Biggie died. We didn't have access to social media. Right now, if I feel like saying something, I just put it on live and talk to my fans. We didn't have that. We found out the latest news through the magazines. So Shaka Khan admittingly says, they got me. I was talking about music. They suckered me in. I said, I regret. I love Mary J. Blige. I love everybody I talked about. But I got tricked. It happened to me for years. I go up, hey, legend, hey, we love you, legend, what's up? Yo, you the, the minute the mic come on, yo, what you think about such and such? Yo, what you think? And I'm over there talking. And so Shaka Khan, living legend icon, she don't know the type of games that they playing. She don't know how they engaging out here. And so they suckered her in. They baited her for clickbait. Next thing you see, Shaka Khan disses this one and that one. Well, she really loves them. Organize, responsibility, simplify. Ever since I put that in my life, I got a board. And it says organize, responsibility, and simplify. Something I learned the other day. My mentor, J.R. Ridinger, who died a billionaire. Uh, he said that we could all, all of you guys, and me, write down on a sheet of paper, what are your goals? What are your dreams? What do you hope is possible? And then you go for that. And every day, you look at this list you made to yourself. Don't know how you're gonna get it, but you're gonna get to it. And everything he wrote on that list 30 years ago, he accomplished it and then some. So you should write down on a list seven, 10 things that you want to accomplish. And I want to thank you very much for watching. It's your boy Andy Appleseed. Andy Appleseed TV is the name of the channel. If you're new here, hit that subscribe, drop me a comment. We got the latest and greatest hip hop news commentary by your boy Andy Appleseed. It's going down. Live stream edits, you name it. Hit that like, catch me in the next video. Peace.